Hello and welcome to this afternoon's talk on application modernization with Relational Migrator. To talk to you a little about how to migrate your application workloads across from traditional relational database designs into the NoSQL universe, we've built and invested in a very unique tool designed to bring your relational workloads to MongoDB with confidence. This relational migrator tool does three things. It helps you design an effective MongoDB schema that is a modern and very tech savvy and agile design. We help you migrate the data both in a test environment and then to do a production grade uh, migration of all of your source data with the transformations if you want to embed content. And finally, to generate code artifacts and the specialist task of converting SQL, custom SQL, SQL contained within your store procedures across to MQL, these aggregation pipelines. We're able to apply uh, a range of sources and basically to pull in data from Postgres, uh, an old Sybase instance, your Oracle production data, and bring them to Atlas, to your on-prem environments, either as a one-time snapshot where it takes the existing setup and then ceases, or a new capability that we are, we'll be talking about today, which is the continuous sync, a long running sync that continually syncs the changes from a source database across uh, into your new MongoDB format with all the transformations. And this is available out of the box today, a new capability that we've been building out. With this, we're going to start a database sync. And these database syncs are going to bring all the previous data that's in there, the current data set, but then we're going to transition to a live database monitoring, continuous monitoring. And this can be running for as long as you need. And it's great for when you have a migration with one of those complex tables I showed you before. And so here, this is going to be a live data migration. And on top of that, we're going to make some edits to see that actually work in real time. So what we're looking at here is the running migration job, which is just transferred. There you go, thank you. Um, transferred about 3000 rows we're actually able to handle a much larger set of data if we want, but it's now switched to monitoring and it's going to monitor the database for changes. The relational migrator tool allows you to generate new access code based on your MongoDB schema to convert the previously mentioned stored procedures, triggers and views. And something that you just saw demo, demoed or mentioned in the previous keynote was the ability to translate that data access code the entity framework across to work with MongoDB. And this is a fantastic set of capabilities because it's completely free and you can try it. Let's go use this live Gen AI query converter and you'll be able to see how this works in a prod environment. So I'm connecting in this case to the source database. My Postgres sampled uh, Northwind environment has a range of stored procedures and views. And I'd like to show you how this tool can automatically translate them from SQL to MQL in near real time. So what I've got, if you look on the left here, is a set of store procedures and views, and we're actually going to just start translating them. So here, uh, I've got a couple of different languages that I can pick as a source. And so I've got a few supported languages. This one I might send over to C. This one I might send over to C Sharp, uh, or to Java, I should say. Um, and we're gonna convert a bunch of these queries uh, in real time. You can already see some of the results are coming in uh, and we can see that it's produced automatically based on the actual map mappings provided uh, of the before and after a, su a suggested resulting MQL query in real time. And we have a lot of customers that are very excited to see this and the amount of time that it saves them versus hiring uh, a team that has expertise in both their source database, SQL uh, and data environment and also in MongoDB's set of tooling. So because the tool helps you to um, to model, to migrate, and to generate these application artifacts. It's great for reducing the risk of a migration project being delayed or worse, failing. So this is something that we've got available today. And if you liked what you saw, the good news is that you can go to the MongoDB website and download that right now and point it in a dev environment so that it's up and running in your environment. And then start playing and visualizing with your database designs to see what that would look like. And then start shipping. So this is something that a lot of our customers start with a small proof of concept that's perhaps running in a local dev environment, 
and they end up running in a much larger environment on bigger projects. And our application is expanding into enterprise space.